So where were we? <laughs> Welcome back, I'm Grimwit from Natch Evil. We're still doing this. Ooh, wait, no, gossip. Word is that Chelsea Harper's parents didn't want her dating anyone. That bites. Except Chelsea Harper's parents. Oh, and this guy. How's it, Angie? I'm going to talk to him every chance I get. <laughs> because stereotypes. Alright, so, uh, it's been about a week since I even tried to do this. So, let's see if I can remember what's happening. Oh, yeah. The fridge magnets. Here, catch. What's this? Uh, a magnet? You know, one of those things you use to hang your report card on the fridge? Opposites attract? Okay, I get it. Thanks. But what do I need one of these for? Because we collect them, silly. That's one that Abigail gave me, and since I'm allergic to ugly things, there's no way I can keep it. You might like it, though. Thanks. Thanks, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Liz knows where it's at. There are two collectibles in this game. Gossip and magnets. Hey, you. What's up? Uh, what's up with yourself? Can you help me out with Petey? I... I don't even, yeah, I'll just... I don't know about that, DJ. Petey? What do you mean? I was in there trying to talk to him, and he just threw me out, sort of. He's just really shy. He probably wanted you to stay, but he didn't know you. Forget that. I don't have time for guys who can't see when a girl is interested in them. Let's see, um... So you think I should give it another shot? Maybe you could talk to Izzy first. Who's that? They're best oh. friends, and don't ask me why, because I have no idea. She's all into sports, and he's all into his music. I don't see what they could have in common. Well, there must be some good things about her if Petey likes her. Not necessarily true. I'm sure he can't hear a word she says because of how loud he plays his music. If that were me, and I couldn't hear her, I might think she was okay, too. I don't know. I'll wait until I meet her. Where can I find her? Bad attitudes are us. I don't know. Seriously, though, she's probably in the sports hall. That's where she always is, just practicing. Cool, thanks. Izzy. She's... I don't like Izzy. We'll get to her. What took so long? I thought you'd be dying to go. I've been right here. I've been right here. Sorry, I got caught up in something. It's okay. Let's get going. <laughs> okay, the mall. This, uh, call it headquarters. So, this is the mall. Or as I affectionately refer to it, shopping heaven. Why didn't you bring me here sooner? I didn't want to overload you. So, how do you want it? Throw you in and see if you can swim? Or give you the rundown on everything? I actually know exactly what I want to do in this mall, but just for those guys who haven't played this game... Just tell me the main places. I'll just explore the rest. I like your thinking. If you want clothes, try as a fish, jeans, big game, party on, picture, or sweats and stretch. You can get jeans just about anywhere, but I go to jeans. They've got the biggest selection and some really good sales. Now, if you want to look good while completely draining your purse, Go to Couture. You won't get a lot for your money, but the shopping bags they give you are so cute, it's almost worth it. One of my favorite places to shop is La Chasseur. The reason? Shoes. Love their shoes. Is your hair getting too frizzy? Too many split ends? Devon hair will fix that right up, and they're not too expensive. If you're normal, you'll like going to the movies. Zoetrope is the best place to do that. And yes, the popcorn costs just about as much as the movie. Alright, clothes is strategy in this game. And our strategy is very specific. We're after one guy after all. Depending on how you look can change the opinion of the person you're trying to date. Uh, first step though... Welcome. How can I help? Makeover. I'll have a makeover, please. Certainly. If you could come over here, please. Alright, I, I turned off the music, but for some reason the music is still here. 
Uh, we'll just cut to what she looks like now, and this is pretty much her look for the rest of the game. Purple eyes. Thank you for coming. I hope you like your new look. I knew a girl with purple eyes. They weren't quite that bright, though. I like it. It looks unnatural. Okay, so what's your plan? What are you looking for? Uh, human blood? I think I'm okay with my wardrobe. All I really want to look at are the earrings, bracelets, belts, and the strappy shoes. Those are accessories. I know, but I love strappy shoes. I always make an exception for them. Who am I to deny a friend from her shopping experience? I will murder your children for strappy shoes. I'll eat a fucking baby for strappy shoes. I'm passing up so many, so many chances to chat and gossip. Uh, I'm going to one place and one place only. I think I mentioned it last episode. It's been about a week and I've been spending most of my time watching Twitch plays Pokemon. Did I, did I just... No. Uh, anyway. <laughs> um, as a fish. You need any help? I'm going with what I know. And I, I was like this dumb goth kid in high school, so... Alright, here's how this works. We got a little thing at the bottom that says whether or not PD likes it. Or any of the other boyfriends if we were doing multiple boyfriends, but we're not. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, that, that Let's Play that I am linking to in the description, uh, th they covered PD, apparently, and I missed that episode, which is very much me. I'm not real sure how I missed it. Anyway, I sent an apology to the guy because I felt really bad. This isn't the first time that I've tried to, to add something to his Let's Play and failed because he'd beaten me to the punch like years earlier and I just miss it. Okay, of course you can try whatever it is you're buying on. That looks slutty enough to be alright. Cool. You know, on a scale of 1 to 10, it's probably a 5 and a half. I think that's all she says. I've never heard her really compliment any of my clothes. Uh, nope, nope, it hasn't happened. Emily, thank you. I really dig your style, man. Of course you do. I shopped here. Dude. Thanks for shopping at As a Fish. You're welcome, dude. Didn't I see you out in the mall earlier? Anyway, we need to get rid of Emily. I'm actually kind of tired right now. I'd love to go shopping, but you'd have to carry me. And I'd like to carry you, but you just slow me down. We'll catch up later. Cool. See ya. Yeah, that being that. Whoa, she just disappeared. Yes? You want my attention? Benny! Man, this school would be so much better without him. Since when is boring better? Whatever, Benny. Whatever. So this is La French Word. Hi. How are you today? And this is the creepiest teller at all the shops. Shoe store is pretty much like everywhere else that sells clothes, only they specialize in all the shoes. All of them. And again, it's an accessory or a clothing, and clothing is strategy. So I'm looking for boots here that uh, that Petey will like, and I won't vomit every time I look at, like these. And they're only 75 bucks. We got 75 bucks. Oh, okay. They're, they're boots. Eventually, I get the boots that I want, or the ones that I deserve. Those shoes are so cute, right? You're creepy. You're creeping me out, man. Just don't talk. La Chasseur thanks you for your business. I... Wow. Why are we not macing this guy? So, other than clothes, a couple of accessories, I think one or two quests, there's the gelato store. And the gelato store, of course, gives us... Oh... Oh... Oh, no. It's... Uh... 
Do you want some gelato? I would like to buy a gelato, please. Of course. Please choose your gelato. I love gelato. It reminds me of Florence in the summer. Gelato. There you go. Enjoy it. Gelato, gelato, gelato. Oh, gelato. Yes. 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 It yes. tastes so, it tastes good. so good. good. Like you, like you, like you. Like like <laughs> so that was a thing. And it's constantly a thing. This is like a running joke or something. Hey. Hey, will you eat gelato with me? Can I have some of your gelato? I I'll sit with you. And we can talk. Talk about gelato. It's so good, right? You love it. Your life is me. Hey, where are you going? Right, anyway. <laughs> so, gelato. Let me know if you have any questions. This is the place where you get gifts. And... <sighs> I'm shopping for a gift. Okay, I, I've been in... Maybe it's because I was like one of those sheltered youths or something, but I never got gifts from girls. I've never even heard of girls giving gifts. In any case, uh, it's, it's pretty easy to point out which boyfriend each gift is day. targeted to. I mean... Time to head home. I can use the map to get there. No kidding. All right. It just says our wardrobe has our stuff. This is our room. We get a little better look at our room. Got a little message from Mom here, asking us where we are. We're home, Mom. We're home. Mom, as you well know, locks you in your room, and you're unable to get through this impenetrable force field wall. That, wait a second, that poster looks familiar. She's got the two of the same posters. Mom really likes that movie. Uh, crummy desk. We'll get to the crummy desk in good time. And time to crash. I wish I could buy new pajamas. Time to wake up, Liz. <laughs> That's a... She sleeps above oh. the covers. I'm cool with that. My wife sleeps above the covers. Wait. Oh, well, unless it's cold. I guess it's not cold ever in Charm Springs. Okay, another tutorial. Yeah, we get it. We know exactly what we're putting on, because we bought it for Petey. Alright, to belt or not to belt? Hmm. Let's keep the belt. And... Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll put on a bangle. And we're out of here. Let's go meet the day. The teacher is in this pose that I call, Why Won't My Hips Unsway? Okay. I try this game every now and then called Block, I guess, where you're trying to block everybody as they're leaving. Nope, nope, you can't leave. Nobody can leave. Nobody can ever leave. Hey, will you gossip with me? Uh, loading. Chelsea Harper's about as friendly as a lion at feeding time. Come on, she's not that bad, is she? Actually, lions like getting food. They're pretty friendly when you're willing to give them a big chunk of meat. I require assistance in finding a classmate who's trying to skip detention. There's some extra credit in it for you, if you can find them. Extra credit? Credit, in addition to that which you've already earned. Heavens. I know what extra credit is. I was just... You're just wasting time. Go! As near as I can tell, doing this quest, which, of course, shows up in the quest log, does nothing. There's no point to doing this quest. We'll do it anyway, because it's damn easy. And, I, you know, I don't really have an excuse. I've got to talk to Petey. I'm stuck. I'd do anything for a candy bar. Anything? anything? Like what? Like, ask you to find me one? That's not too desperate. But okay. What would you do for a Klondike bar? Would you... Would you kill a man? Pretty easy quest. I think this is a, um... Oh, I don't even 
even sure what to call it. We, I think this is like a, an introduction or a tutorial to giving gifts to boys. Emily, Emily, be my friend, Emily. Emily, I'm so alone. There you go. One gift. Oh, there's so many different things I could give him. Candy, my love. The Candy Bar Express is here. Great. I was getting the shakes. You might get those after this. It's made with super sugar. Super sugar. When sugar isn't good enough. Eh, we'll let him have his candy. What's the best thing in the school's cafeteria? The exit. Use it to go somewhere else and eat. I like the gelato place at the mall. Maybe we could go there together. Maybe some other time. Come with me, PD. <laughs> Uh, I gotta pick up some dry cl cleaning at the mall for mom. Good for, uh, for monies. It's another quest. As you can see. No, we're not done talking to you, Petey. Oh, okay, I guess we are. <laughs> ah, good, a fridge magnet. Hooray. Now, I was gonna stop the video here, but, um, yeah, I'm... We'll just keep on going. What's this? Okay. Is that... What? How do you... How do they even... Oh, well. Also, all of my icons are over my... <laughs> all of my friends and heart icons are over the pop-up. wonder how that works. Now that doesn't have anything to read in it either. I guess PD is the keeper of the lore of the school. Let's go someplace else via phone travel. Okay, we're going back to the mall. We'll go other places eventually, but right now we have business here. We must pick up the laundry. I... I, I visit a mall a lot, mostly to get a look at some of the crazy people that will go there. Most of them are jerks. This is Maryland. But, um... Nothing looks quite like this. This mall. Wait a second, aren't you from Azafish? Azafish. As Azul fish. Blue fish. It must be a blue fish reference. What what could it be a reference to? I I really don't know enough about malls. Need to get some stains out. Uh, how did you know? Who's, who have you been talking to? I'm here to pick up an item. Of course, dear. Here you go. Thanks. Lovely to see you, dear. Please come again. Thanks. See you later. I didn't realize there was a mini game there too. Ooh, we got a message. Uh, no, no, no message. Oh, here we go. It is from the mom. She has given us money. I I'm not real sure how to get it. Oh, we have another message. Oh, okay. Two of them. Yes! Oh god, yes, I do want to hang out. Please be my friend. Uh, okay. I'm not really interested in jeans. So I'll fast forward looking for this gelato place. How can I help you? I waited a long time. Uh, I'm here work. for the job. Great, just to fill the orders as they come through the kitchen. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm no good at this game. I was never good at this game. I am going to skip over the tutorial of this game. You'll get how it works pretty easily by watching me mess up. I waited for a long time for, uh, who is it, Olivia? I can't even remember girls' names. And she, she never showed up. I don't even know what the deal is. I guess eventually she will. This game right here... It goes kind of slow, but it is surprisingly, um, okay, that won't work while, while it's filling. It is surprisingly troublesome to pull off. I'm, I don't really know why. Like, uh, have you ever seen that, that episode of, um, Lucy, that I Love Lucy? Everybody knows the episode. That, that's what it feels like. Like, if you mess up, even just a little bit, it feels like you've 
just destroy the entire game, or whatever. And most of it comes from having to refill the ice cream. I'm sorry, gelato. Whatever the difference is. Anyway, I, I actually don't like this game. Break time. Huh. I guess there's a strategy involved here that I don't know about. As you can tell, I've sped it up quite a bit. You'll thank me if you ever get to play it yourself. <laughs> I love how they just fall off the edge. Hey, 120 bucks, that's... Uh, thank that's, you for your help. Here are your wages. That's nothing to sneeze at. And... Ah! Hi. I got your message. Great. So, are you up for it? Up for... Yes? Sure. I'm ready. Let's go. Oh. Pr promenade. I, I haven't gone here yet. Well, I've gone here, but just not in this save. We'll get to it. So, how do you like it here? It's okay, but... I love it. This is the best town I've ever lived in. Really? Where are you from? Everywhere. New York, LA, London. But this place is by far the best. Oh, by wow. far. That's great. What about the boys? Are they better too? I'll, I'll be honest. Uh, I'm, I'm gay? So far, they're just okay. Yeah, they can take some getting used to. Hang in there. Give them a chance. Try being more open-minded. You never know what's under the surface. By the way, has Trimble been on your case lately? Oh my god, yes. What hasn't she told me? Her life story, her sure complaints? Sure has. What's up with her? Beats me. She's been coming down hard on all the girls lately. Maybe she doesn't like us talking to the boys. Why not? Someone should tell her it's not the Middle Ages. Anyway, looks like I have to go now. Goodbye. Okay, thanks for the gelato. <laughs> no problem. See you around. Yeah, thanks for pulling me, like, you know, a couple of blocks out of my way, and I don't even know what I'm doing here. It's getting late. I better head home. Uh, I can use the map to head home. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Oh, another tutorial. I, it's a way that you can change, like, the carpeting and the wallpaper and the gigantic circular picture in the background. And frankly speaking, um... I'm, I'm just going to skip this. Let's see, I have a, a new desk. Part of the tutorial again, you just get one. What's this say? Oh no, the sale's finished. What, what will I do? Alright, let's make sure this is nice and in the way. I need something bigger than a desk for this, but... I wanted that there because you can have a dance-off. You get money doing this. I, I don't know who's giving you money. Now, <laughs> remember how earlier in the first episode I shut off the music? Yeah. Yeah, this... This is... The, the sound is actually there. I, I didn't remove the sound. But since I rem lowered the music so low... This is what I'm dancing to. Abject silence. Yeah! Oh, and an occasional yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm debating whether or not I should add music in post yeah! or just have this com completely quiet. I don't miss a single note. This is... An absurdly easy mini game. <laughs> so, um, dancing. Also, personally, I don't think Liz would be wearing, you know, be caught dead wearing this. Uh, we'll just speed it up. <laughs> I like how the, there's just so much here. And so much that it needs. Like, the dancing teddy bear is great. Kind of reminds me of Teddy Ruxpin. Remember that? I guess I'm too old. The creepy bear who would haunt your nightmares. Well, I've got one that just dances to music. With headphones instead of speakers. 
That makes sense. I'm already over the metal, so I win. <laughs> and she dances up and down. I got a hundred bucks. I assume that hundred bucks came from the stalker who has cameras in my room. Alright, these are the fridge magnets. I love you. No, I love you, Petey. No, I love you. No, I love you. You, you. Uh, you can go in the corner. I love you. I love you. Play some records. No. Yes. <laughs> I have no life. <laughs> so this is what I'm doing with myself, and uh, I guess I'll see you guys <laughs> next time. So, how do you like it here? I love it. This is the best town I've ever lived in.